As far as Aguadol's. It's right down the road a piece. You going to the contest? Mm-hmm. Looking for a friend. Mamacita, that's not very nice. Oh, 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 oh. Mamacita, that's not very nice. Hey, relax, Pancho. We're just being friendly. What about the bottle? What bottle? That bottle. <gasps> Are you brain damaged, you taco bender? You and your putrid reef had green breath. Did you see what you did? Uh-oh. That was Spider's personal bottle. He brought it in with him. I say you owe us for it. I saw him. Pick it up. Are you calling me a liar? Don't touch me, unless you love me. Saying he's sorry makes a man feel better. I'm sorry. Not to me, to them. Come on. I'm sorry. Come on, Mr. You know, Willard, you're supposed to have adoption papers to have one of them kids. 
No, no. Andy's my friend. Willard takes real good care of Andy. Nothing bad ever happens to Andy. Well, no papers. I'm gonna have to throw you in a slammer. <laughs> Again? Yeah, you can clean out them slop buckets real good. <laughs> and we'll just sort of forget about them papers. Where can I find Tick Rand? <laughs> well, looky what we got here, boys. I mean, this must be one of them cycle cycles <laughs> that we see in the moving pictures. You come here to tear up our town, boy? Or maybe get lucky with one of our women, huh? Yeah, maybe get lucky with one of our... Katie. <laughs> I don't believe it. The last time I saw you, you were like a little kid. Yeah. <laughs> Kids grow up. I can see that. Oh, smoker. Oh. Ah. Yeah, I can see that. Uh, guys, this is Ben Stryker. Dear friend of my father's. Well, any friend of yours, Miss Rand? friend of mine. We're having us a little celebration this afternoon at the Tomcat Bar. I'd really like you to come there. Maybe. I'm really looking forward to it. I mean, I'd really like you to be there. Hey, there's a big juicy steak waiting for you at home. like a real nice home. Yeah, I guess it does. Still missing one or two things, though. Stryker, are you coming home? Where's Tech? Him and Danny are up at the gold mine. So uh, why don't you run up on there while I put on some lunch, huh? Dad talks about you. Sometimes. Never seen a bike like that. The Duchess? Yeah, I mean, I, I got magazines and stuff, but, uh... I'll give you a ride later. Just tick inside? Yeah. Come on. He's been waiting for you. Striker, you old son of a bitch. You don't write, we get one lousy phone. But where you been, Beirut? El Salvador. It's all behind me now, Tick. Yeah, me too. Danny, take Striker's jacket so he's a little more at home. Oh, sure, let me take that for you, Mr. Striker. Just Striker. Okay, Striker. Go on down the hill and help your sister with lunch. But Dad, I was just gonna hang around. I'll give you a ride later. Right? Right. Okay. How long are you staying? 
Can I let you know? <laughs> well, Hal, you can stay here just as long as you want to. You know that. Nah, I'll stay in town. So it looks like you really dug in here, Tick. Well, that's a little different than designing weapons for the company. You were the best there was. The best there is. Huh. That's live. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> You remember Mugamba's headquarters when we blew that guy up? Oh. Tin cans and nails oh. stuffed in pig dung. <laughs> oh, we hit that mother with a tick ram special. The old shit bomb. <laughs> that was a time. Yeah, so what are you doing here? Well, my pension from the government is enough to make ends meet. This is what really keeps me going. I didn't know you were interested in this. Well, I'm not really. The spring that fed this town dried up about five years ago, and you can't get to the gold without water, so the mine closed up about two months later. For the last several years, this town has been dying a slow and miserable death. And you care? And I care. What are we looking for, absolution? I don't know exactly what I'm looking for, whatever you want to call it, meaning the reason for living, I don't know. I do know that you and I brought flaming hell to a lot of towns over the years. Just once, I'd like to bring a town some hope. What are you looking forward to, Stryker? That nice, juicy steak that Kate's gonna cook for me. I'm doing the best I can, Becky Sue. The very best I can. Look, we'll get, we'll get there in plenty of time. The convention doesn't start until noon I'll tomorrow. Screw your convention. No, boy, this is really a dumbass idea. I didn't suspect from the beginning. Suspect? Suspect what? Well, this is a business trip, Becky Sue. Uh, <laughs> you're my secretary. Secretary? <laughs> Floyd, the woman is not a complete moron. I type one word per minute, and then it's usually misspelled. observed the southern migration of the sperm whale because I think I see one of their species looming on the horizon and I think he's just about ready to blow and so are you. Says all yours, meat rat. Floyd! Well, that's nice. Real nice. Hey, pal, you better save her for pig iron, you jerk. <laughs> Zero! Floyd, do something! Shut up, Becky Sue! Yeah, Floyd. Do something. Ah! Oh, Floyd would like to help you out, but he's in a little pinch right now. <laughs> well, you look like a man with a problem, Floyd. But then again, I guess a man's got to know his limitations. <laughs> hey. 
Why are we stopping? Wait, hold on. Oh, man. Stay here. Lord, if you'll permit me, maybe I can help you solve your problem. Boy, if you'll pay attention, watch. I'll give you a little instruction. The <laughs> Too bad. Save a little. Hey guys, he ain't even here. So what are you gonna do? Nothing. Oh, come on. What about that girl? Hey, you can't leave her. There's 25 of them and one of me. Well, what about me? You do it. Funny. A legend, you know. Tonight the legend comes alive. Mm, every Tom Cat in the county comes down here to prove he's the toughest son of bitch around. I'm looking forward to seeing you in there tonight. I ain't got nothing to prove. Hey, Kate! Well, I'm sorry I'm late. You yeah. <laughs> are? I thought she was just plain sorry. Deep down, she's a real sweet girl. Way deep down. Hey, Danny. How you doing? Hey, Danny. What brings you into town? Take Katie for a ride on my bike. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we're real Democrats here, Mr. Stryker. What? What? Just about anybody could climb into that ring and see what kind of a man he is. Don't need no experience. No entry fee. Just a little guts. <laughs> and I'm gonna save the next dance for you. I don't dance. What? They're playing our song, sweetie. Like I said.
you doing here? Well, I, I came to check out the scene. Are you going to enter the contest? Me? Nah, I think I'll wait till next year. It's kind of hot in there, so I thought I'd watch the action from out here. Oh. Want to watch? My parents are waiting up for me. Oh. Uh, I was thinking you might want to go for a ride on my bike. I'd like that. How about tomorrow? I'll be out in front of the church at 7. All right. You cowboys is gonna get out out there and go for the go. Man, don't you want to feel your muscles? Snap. You want to slap somebody's body down and some food in the overwhelming room? You know what to do! your little soiree. Hey! What do you say? Ave! Ave! Kubi Sabusa! Hey! 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 For anybody who wants to stay in the ring with a certain dude in this room. Five hundred dollars for stomping on a deputy. <laughs> Shit, lady. My boys can get you for the fuck. <laughs> Please, a pretty woman like you. You know what I mean? <laughs> you won't kiss me, deputy? <laughs> well, looky what we got us here. We ought to learn that boy some manners. You boys don't want to fuck with him. Take her, and that's a piss hand. Look, I just got finished telling you that you boys do not want to fuck with him. You know what I mean? Now we came here to party, right? I'm a buddy zero over here. If you might please just stomp on that deputy you got over there. What's his name? Smooch Bob or something? He's not doing shit like that. I do like doing shit like that. <laughs> yeah, I like to stomp them real good. Till her face gets all red and squishy. <laughs> and they always start to cry and beg me to stop. But I don't stop. <laughs> and you know why, my man? Because that is the best part. <laughs> Yeah. 
Let's go on home. I'm tired. She got a brand on her ass. Uh-oh, he don't believe us. <laughs> Tell the sacred man with his tit-sucking eyes how you found heaven on the back of a heart. Taste of the forbidden fruit. Savages never lose.
cheated. You lost. Is that right, Tom? That's right. Hey, man, savages don't lose! Sure, why don't you back off for five or ten minutes, man, and go take a piss or something, huh? God damn it, I said now. Fuck off, old man. I'm telling you one time, asshole. Call off your race. Oh, pull the trigger. He never has. And he never will. I see. Tough man, just like the deputy over there, huh? Is that what you are? You gonna shoot me? Go oh, on, shoot me, then. Because if you ain't gonna shoot me, I'm gonna take that little gun away, and I'm gonna shove it up your big fat ass, and I'm gonna pull the trigger. That's what I'm gonna do. Maybe you like that, huh? Maybe you like it to make your day. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, the belly, the balls, looks like old uh, Joe Bob or Jim Bob or Reed Bob done recovered, huh? Hmm? My, my, looks like all the local mice done got themselves firearms now, boys. <laughs> Myself, oh, man. Huh? Come on, we better get out of here, savages. Oh, These towns, folks, they got some sales. Fire off. Ain't there. nothing shaking but the leaves on the trees, Jack. I'm ordering you all to leave this town immediately. And we'll retain your friend here just to show you how serious we really are. And that's a bad move there, Mayor, or Reverend, or whatever the fuck you are, man. I just hope you know what the fuck you're doing. I'll tell you what, man, I'm going to be back. I'm going to be back for you. And I'm going to be back for you. And I'm going to be back for you motherfucker! Yeah. 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 Let's go. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. Come back to you. Take me with you. You think you're good enough to hang with me? I can suck start a Harley.
like to make it with a real man. Run, Fred, get out of here! Hey, we was just having ourselves a little old party down there. We thought maybe you'd like to come out and play, huh? <laughs> come on, drag him, boys. Now it's personal like, you know, between you and me. That's why we seeing you real soon, you know what I mean, boy?
glad to see you. Glad to be here. Especially you. All the girls are here. Ha <laughs> ha! We'll be back. You know who I am? I'm your worst nightmare. Come true. <laughs> All right, let's roll! Don't baby. Picture, you? No kid outside. 
pops out like a flat tire. He. Yeah, maybe some old guy with a hard luck story wanting to talk to him. Yeah, which we don't need. Well, not at all. Better him than us, though, huh? Yeah. Don't shoot! Don't shoot! Don't shoot! Oh, no, we're not going to shoot. You can see that we're not carrying any concealed weapons. Bunch of bikers drove us off the road. Oh, isn't that a shame? Hey, is this candy camera? Are we on camera? Hey, Francis, come on. They might be telling the truth. I saw the motorcycle freaks on the highway this afternoon. If you guys could help us out, we'd be real grateful. Well, it's against regulations, and we... I no mean, way. like, we can't afford to pay you, but I'm sure we could work something out. <laughs> Francis, come in. Francis, we got us an obligation. Here we go. Look, come on, the whole battalion's on maneuvers. All we gotta do is cover for each other. Yeah, but Colonel Edwards is gonna have our ass. Oh, man, ain't nobody gonna have our ass. Unless, of course, we want him to. Come on, guys. What do you say? I mean, you can't just leave us out here to freeze to death. Just a minute. What's this, Katie? I want to show you something special. harmless enough from up here. Used to be have a lot nicer down there, too. Now it's just another town waiting to die. Francis. What do you think? Look. You see that motto on that sign there, Francis? Yep. To serve and protect. Right. Well, those young ladies are in urgent need of protection. Mm -hmm. Very high, yeah. And maybe a little servicing. <laughs> Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. Come on, <laughs> open it. I'll do it. I'll do it. your special place? Yes. I come here sometimes to paint. Usually just to be alone and to think. To be alone and to think, that's the story of my life. You know what I don't know? Who are the good guys? Who are the bad guys? I don't know what the fuck it's all about. Oh, shit. Are the good guys? Me and Tick and all the guys would give a damn. And you don't need to be alone. Buddy's here, he'll come out and play. Uh oh. Doesn't look like Mole Larry and Curly done got me covered again. Whoops. Can I tell you what a pleasure it is to have you back again? <laughs> Joe Bob's Nover is down home hospitality. It's gonna be a real privilege having a man of your stature as our guest. <laughs> Hey, bro! Am I glad to see you? Shit, man. I knew you wouldn't leave me behind. You are my main man. I wouldn't leave you behind. <laughs> you may be a bit of a psychopath, 
that I didn't figure you were stupid. What made you come back? Well, you know, Sheriff, I gotta tell you, you know, I, I took a real liking to your town, you know. I thought maybe I'd come back here and party a bit. I mean, I seen all your women give them in the eye something fierce, and I just thought maybe I'd come back and service them all, you know what I mean? Let him get a real man for a change. Move, asshole. Before I squeeze this trigger, and pretty up your face. <laughs> Hey, Zero! Looks like we're gonna be hanging out in there for a while, buddy. We're gonna have a little party now. Shit, I knew you wouldn't leave me behind. Hey, Sheriff, you mind if I use your telephone? I feel like calling up my mom. Don't worry about this garbage. I'll take care of them real good. And <laughs> Joe Pa's gonna trash it. The trash. <laughs> you little head while you're down there, short sure. He's off, Joe Bob. Something wrong here. I want to give a call over to the state police, see if they can keep an eye on the rest of that gang. You feel real good there, asshole, huh? You feel good, man. He's off, Joe Bob. Lime's dead. You all right? The surprise you did, you bro. <laughs> Come on, you redneck son of a bitch! Come on out here, boy. I gotta do some props. Hey, tough man! Come on, shit kicking, you dumb motherfucking ass! Uh -huh. I'm gonna do it again, asshole! Do it again, motherfucker! any goddamn outside guest, you know what I mean? <laughs>
Don't be frightened, my loving child. Is it? You're in the house of the Lord. Well, I'm not frightened. Not of you. Oh. You seek comfort, my child. You see, God sent you to me to comfort me in my in my war against sin. You know that power. That made you stray from the path of righteousness to wallow in lust and sin. I have sinned. <laughs> well, contact with a sacred vessel will purify you. Before you are ready. Oh, well, now, big thing. Man, huh? help, boy. It's a natural thing. Huh? Ain't nobody got to know about this. I know that you're a respected man in the community. I wouldn't want to go mess that up for you. No, wouldn't want to mess that up at all. <laughs> but you shut the fuck up, man. Oh God, no. Tell you what, man. I promise you, man. I ain't going to tell no one. Hey, thank you. Of course, you know, you don't have to pay the piper. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> Amazing grace, how sweet the sound that saved a man. Man, I wanted a fucking haircut. Stryker, I, I didn't see you. You weren't meant to. How can we help you, Reverend? Well, as a matter of fact, I... are back. Now, look, this isn't easy. We've come to ask for your help before somebody else gets hurt. Now you want our help. What's happened to Agua Dulce's finest? Look, just for tonight. By late tomorrow, we can count on the guard if we have to. These guys are slick. They wouldn't come back unless they had an edge. Tick, please, before someone else gets hurt. Look. He had a gun. Ah! He made me do it, Tick. Enjoy it! I did. Enjoy it, my friend. Enjoy it. Well, this is going to be your last victory. Because we possess the weapon. 90,000 pound armor plated green killing machine. Now, come on! I'm sure, I'm sure a lawyer of your considerable experience who's led so many other men to death 
He's prepared to fight his final battle. So join me! All of you, join me! This night, and that good coach. Join me in hell. <laughs> ah! Ah! <laughs> Mr. Stryker, I... Tick, I, I'm sorry, I... Mr. Stryker, I... Tick, I... taking your daughter and your son down there for a firefight with 30 psychopaths. It's insane. It's suicidal. That mine shaft goes clear through the mountain to the center of town. We got the element of surprise. With my weapons and your fighting skills, we can do nothing. You're not part of the real world. You've been isolated too long. I'm not taking people I care about into a fight. I'm not leading anybody into a fight to the death ever again. Not ever. I won't do it. Everything you need?
doing? We're fighting back. Hey, can I help? Yeah, give me some gasoline. All right. Right here. And then you start counting. And when you get to ten, I want you to be far away. You understand? So when you get to twenty, Andy is gonna go boom and kill all those bad men. You understand? Willard understands. They, they hurt Andy real bad. Now Andy will get him good. You betcha. Andy's gonna get him good.
shit! Time to repent, my man of God. <laughs> I got, I got a little surprise for you. Just wait right there.
do it to him! Back off, Grant. Everybody back off! Back off! Who is mine? You've been having yourself a real good time, ain't you? Well, that's good. And cannons and bombs, and that guy gets me with a with, with a bullet that, that big.
for you. Exhausted, you wounded, my friend. The end is near. Come out, Striker. Come out, my man. You're gonna die, Striker. Gonna do, Riker! Leave me here to die! Ah! 